Welcome to Pro Tips, I'm Brian Gendro, and at your average college you can learn how to maybe throw a football, play some golf, but today here at the University of North Dakota, I'm teaming up with UND Aerobatics and I'm going to learn how to flip a plane. So today the plan is we'll go out in the aircraft and we'll basically show you a little bit what aerobatics is about, how to fly a little bit and see what the controls do. And so our basic plan is uh, first just getting the aircraft just kind of turn and, and get a little bit comfortable with the controls. You'll be in the back seat, so you'll be looking past me, but the view is going to be very, very good. In the aircraft, uh, you'll have some rudder pedals. That'll be your feet. That'll control the yawing portion. And normally, we're not going to use that to turn, um, but it keeps us coordinated and comfortable as we do turning and some different things. The main controls you'll have is, is very act it's actually very much like the uh, a fighter aircraft. You've got a stick control, and a throttle will be on your left. Okay. So normally, for most of our maneuvers, we just have power on. Uh, the stick, that's where we'll control, let's see, elevator, you pull back, the nose will go up, push forward, the nose will go down. And then right stick will roll you to the right, and then left will roll you left. What we're going to do is, is we're going to perfect the roll. And basically that's, that's kind of your, your entry maneuver to get into things. And if you can perfect the roll, then more advanced maneuvers become much easier. The first roll we'll do is, is a basic uh, aileron roll. We'll bring the aircraft up to about 30 degrees and then we'll roll it, and as we do that, we'll let it ballistically fall through the maneuver. What the circle will be is, it, as we're trying to roll the aircraft, it, they sometimes call it sacred circle. And what will happen is the nose will actually make kind of a circle on the horizon around the point that you're trying to roll. As we get the stick over, we're gonna start with a little bit of rudder to keep it coordinated, to keep things smooth, and that way it keeps the nose tracking straight. But as soon as you get to about 45 degrees of bank, a little bit higher than that, you need to transition to the top side. You know, keep the nose from falling through. So you've got to use the whole body gets into it. <laughs> okay. So stick will go over, push forward a little bit, come back, and keeping it smooth is going to be a key to making it look nice. The other thing I'll have you do since we're in the airplane, we're having some fun, is your, your standard loop. So you got to get upside down and do a loop, right? Yeah. Easy, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this one, uh, let's see, you'll sign on this part here, which is just basically your standard release. Um, let's see. Just try, hold harmless, University of North Dakota and me. Uh, yeah, property damage, personal injury, or death. It's, it's not that part. Negligence. Ne well, it won't be negligence. Okay. <laughs> so should we go get a plane? <laughs>